I have been running trading for around 18 months. I have lost uh, some money and back on demo for now. Recently, finding your Ichimoku series and videos is very uh, is a breath of fresh air. I feel very blessed. You have inspired me with new learning and a fresh mindset and an opportunity to trade properly and hopefully profitable this time. Thank you. Sure. You are very welcome. So, my question is apart from the uh, practicalities of trading, margins, spreads, risk management, etc., right? Is there anything I can do to prepare myself mentally and emotionally since last year's loss? My confidence is very shaky. So, yeah, I, ha I have gone through those times when uh, I was not really confident on the trade, so I know how you feel. And let me tell you my experience. My own experience is first of all, I when I start to lose uh, over time, I went back to demo account just like you did. I went back to demo account. So and also I uh, I started to take journals on my own trades, and I was looking back on my past trades every week, uh, what I did, how I did, and how I felt afterwards. I put those comments on the journal so that I can look back on every weekend and uh, prepare for the uh, upcoming week. Plus, uh, if I'm not confident on the market, I decided to stay away. And that was that's the another another rule that I set. So yeah, when you see that when if you're not really confident, first of all, it's not really the time to tr uh, trade real money. You better keep trading with demo account. But if you go away from the market, that means you're losing the skill and you are losing the experience. So I recommend you to just stick with the chart. Just keep watching the chart every day at least. Without thinking anything, you can just keep watching the chart at least. So that you can be still be you know in part of the forex market, and if we want to take trades, start with demo account. So that uh, and you take journals by trading that demo account, and you look back yourself. And sometimes you might find some patterns, like maybe when you are trading outside, maybe your performance might be lower, or when you are trading right after you you are full right right after you ate some food and you became full maybe your performance might be getting lower so you will find yourself what kind of uh, habit you have in yourself by taking journals and looking back and this is a very important uh, part first of all to be psychologically prepared and also in terms of the money management you have to get at numbers uh, you have to not only look at the risk to reward ratio or win to lose uh, ratio but also there are other concepts uh, like a R multiple or a profit factor max drawdown and everything everything yeah if you haven't watched the video yet i have the risk management related videos yeah if you come to my channel um, i have a playlist right here for money management and also here are money, money management and mental techniques for forex trading and I have been talking about those topics here so if you come to the playlist and learn it that'd be great but yeah that's my that's my recommendation so yeah it's good that you came back to demo account first and what you can do now next is that you start to take journals and you start to look back on yourself and then you will find about yourself right you will find what you should do and what you should not do before taking trades or when you lose what you should do when you win what you should do right uh, you can find those information about yourself and that's very important so yeah, that's my advice but yeah thank you for sending me the question so for me I was uh, to me um, usually when I take trades I, um, I promise myself to be alone first of all I won't take trades when there are people in front of me or there are friends with me I won't take trades I never I, I don't even look at the charts and also when I'm full when I take too many sugars or too many carbs then I won't take trades because I feel get dual so uh, yeah I, I don't really take trades at that time and what else um, I don't play the music uh, while I'm trading or while I am doing the analysis I want to play music and yeah I meditate every day I meditate in the morning right after I wake up I meditate for five minutes 
and just calm myself down. And whenever I lose trace, I and whenever I feel that I became emotional, I just cl close my eyes for five minutes and just try to clear my mind. That's my another habit. But these kind of things are all based on my journals because I was taking journals and those are the findings that I found uh, when I tend to lose in the market. Of course, strategy is very important, but this kind of habit, right? You have to find your own habit to keep grounded yourself. And this is also very important. So that's my advice. 